those issues are issues to be resolved. Whether we are ready or not, we have to start somewhere. It can start today or tomorrow, but the point is uh, we have to plan and start somewhere. If we don't have to plan, if we don't have any plan at all, uh, there's no action to be taken in the future. So what we should do now is to plan and to take action immediately. Yeah, whether we are capable to do it now or later, doesn't matter. As long as we really have uh, something to do to make sure that this issue can be resolved. It can take one, two, three, five years, but it has got to be resolved. Our position is actually much better than those people there. Uh, jadi, kita akan bekerjasama bilateral di atas kedua-dua negara. Uh, kita pastikan yang kita hantar itu uh, tidak berpenyakit, tidak mempunyai uh, COVID-19 yang positif. Saya dah melawat beberapa detention centre bukan hanya di Sabah tapi juga di, di seluruh negara. Kita mempunyai masalah kerana tempat-tempat ini agak sudah penuh dengan mereka-mereka. Kita strategi-strategi yang tertentu, contohnya yang ada di Semenanjung, kita telah pun menghantar mereka pulang. to politics, uh, everyone has answers to whatever issues, whatever problems, and, uh, and uh, it becomes speculations uh, that everyone can actually uh, uh, discuss and talk about. But for me, it's very simple. I'm a person who like to see apapun yang berlaku mestilah diselesaikan dengan secepat mungkin. Doesn't matter whatever that or what what whatever that they have said, yang pentingnya uh, adalah kita mencari penyelesaian. Penyelesaiannya bagaimana? Kalau hari ini betul-betul TYT telah pun setuju uh, untuk uh, apa ini, Ketua Menteri membubarkan uh, State Assembly, uh, maka keputusannya kalau benar, betul, uh, maka we face it. And all of us have to decide for the future of our leadership ministry. We'll do it together and I'll memastikan siapa yang lebih baik uh, Saya yakin uh, Tun Johar tidak akan menyalahgunakan kebutuhan uh, dan untuk menjadi seorang uh, head of state uh, biarlah dia bertanggungjawab di atas apa yang dia Tun Mahathir pernah berkata bahawa inilah jadi masalah orang Melayu. Apabila nak jadi presiden, uh, tidak boleh menang lagi, maka tubuhlah uh, parti yang baru. Itu kata-kata dia tu. Uh, bukan daripada saya. With that kind of uh, uh, ni, uh, thinking that he has, dia masih lagi nak menubuhkan parti baru. Terpulang. Masing-masing ada rights untuk menubuhkan uh, parti. Uh, kalau kita ada 32 juta, kalau kita divide by 30, kita boleh ada 20 juta, 1 juta parti. Tiga orang ada 30 orang. No, as I said, every, everyone has got their own rights to form. Jadi, uh, you should not ask me about apa masalah, karena masalah tak timbul.